All right, you've done some drone panoramic videos with your DJI, and you now need to stitch them together because it doesn't do that for you. No problem. It's pretty quick and easy to do in Lightroom Classic. First thing you need to do is import your pictures. So within the library pane, go to import. Go to the folder wherever you've got the pictures, select them. And then um, you can keyword them, you can add them to a collection if you want, and then hit import. The reason why mine are all grayed out is because I've already imported them. Once you've imported them, select the ones that you want to use for your panoramic. In this case, I've selected these ones right here, one through nine. Most of your DJI panos are going to be nine images. Once you've selected the images, right click, go to Photo Merge, Panoramic. It's going to automatically merge them based on one of these three options, spherical, cylindrical, or perspective. So let's go with spherical for this one, which is usually the default. And you can see it has merged them together, but since it does move around a bit, you can now adjust your boundary warp. And you'll see it kind of stretches it now to look a bit more natural. Pretty good. If you have a little bit of edge, what you can do as well, and this one it doesn't, but I'm going to purposely leave it down at 89. And then you can hit this fill edge option. And it will use some generative fill to fill in those edges. Uh, so kind of a nice little feature. FYI, you can do this really with any pano shots. It's the same process. Doesn't necessarily need to be stuff you take with the DJI drone. There we go. Let's take a look at my merged image. Looks pretty good. At this point, I would go into my develop pane and within the develop page, you can do your various edits to tweak it and make it look better. Within here, one thing I would do is go to this option here, lens correction. Click on that. You've got enable profile correction. Click on that. Change your make to DJI. In this case, I'm going to go DJI Mavic Pro. And you can see it tweaked it a little bit more and you can still play with your distortion just a bit if you want or if you feel your need to. And since this is a pano stitch of multiple images, if I want to make it look a bit more panoramic, I can select my crop and start playing around with the crop a little bit if I want. So maybe uh, I'm going to be putting it online or using it for a video. And that's it. There you go. That's how you stitch together your panoramic images from your DJI drone.